Hey y'all. Hi. It's Laura, Precious's mom. Here's Precious. And she's sporting a new outfit. Check the shirt out. Anybody that knows me? Hello, it's giraffes. Look it. Okay, okay. Calm down. She's nervous because she's at the table and she's not supposed to be. And um, for those of you that aren't already subscribers, make sure you give me the thumbs up. Um, hit that bell. Subscribe, like. Like I said, it's Laura's. Laura Precious's mom. Precious with an apostrophe S. Alright, so with that being said, I've got all kinds of goodies that we have gotten from a couple. So this is going to be a long haul. So, I'm Precious. It's going to be a long one? Yeah. Is it going to be a long haul? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, she's giving me loving. She missed mama. Alright, so. Grab your coffee, tea, soda, iced tea, iced drink, because it is hot out. So with that said, we're going to start showing them what we got, huh? You want to show them? All right. What do we want to show first? Want to show the, ch the cheese crackers? Mmm, cheese crackers. And Precious is sniffing these right out. They've never had these at the Dollar Tree before that I know about. And these are seven ounces. Can't beat it for a buck. I heard that they're not as, they're pretty good considering that they came from the Dollar Tree and they're the Dollar Tree variant. This is a repeat. I buy this all the time. It's the Pop Weaver kettle corn. You get three bags in here, two minutes in the microwave, bam, you got some yummy popcorn. And I get those every now and again. Also, I grabbed a Pillsbury yellow, a traditional yellow cake mix because I'm going to do a dump cake with some of the apples and blueberries that I bought at the Dollar Tree. You dump the blueberries and the apples in, you put that on top, you put some butter. Mm. I'm going to have to do a video for you. I promise eventually I'm going to do these videos. I will. Alright, also, I got some chocolate frosting. And you're probably wondering, uh, people, people that know me probably think, why is she buying all this sweet stuff? I don't even know. But at any rate, I bought this because what I'm going to do, this is the Pillsbury, and it is 10 ounces, so you can't beat this. For a buck, you really can't beat this. What I'm doing is I've got a jar of peanut butter as well, and I'm melting this for a minute in the microwave, and I'm melting my 10 ounce jar of peanut butter in the microwave for a minute, and obviously one at a time. First you do this one, pour it in. A wax papered um, 8x8 or 9x8 whatever that one squarish pan is and then you take the peanut butter and you melt that for a minute sometimes it takes a little bit longer it depends on your microwave and you mix the peanut butter in with the this two ingredient fudge two ingredients BAM you have fudge and it's yummy fudge and it's peanut butter chocolate fudge so that makes it even better yet just saying just putting it out there for you also I grabbed the 10 ounce Pillsbury the confetti it's got the confetti on top I figured this would be fun to make another eventually down the road I figured out I grabbed that oh sorry knocked you down oh oh hold on this is what happens when you go live oh my Oh my. Sorry guys. Oh. Precious? No. She hears somebody outside. I think they're taking out the recyclables. Alright, and I also have a chicken fling. I say an A because there were two, but my friend obtained the first one. And this is the chicken flings. Apparently they work pretty good because people in her car are going crazy over the chicken fling. I also bought this for my grandson. It's time for bed, little chick. I thought this was adorable. I got him this. His birthday is tomorrow. He's a year old already tomorrow. I don't know where the time went. Went too fast. Then I've got Roller Buddies. And if you open it up, it's a pop-up book. How cute is this? And his theme this year for his birthday is dinosaurs. And even if he wrecks it the first time, which he probably will, because he's only one. But... I just thought it was cute. It's only three pages, but it's adorable. He'll he'll love it. And because 
His grandma loves to get books. I love to get books for my grandsons. This is the animals. And look at this. It comes with the CD. It makes the farm animals. Animal sound. Old McDonald had a farm. Bingo. Mary had a little lamb. Baba Black Sheep. The farmer in the dell. I bought me a cat. If only I had a dog. Down by the bay. The old gray mare. The rattling bog. And over in the meadow. So it's got all these little music CDs included with this book. And it shows a cow and, you know, not that he can't go out to my mother's and see a cow, but, you know, or the chickens. My mother has chickens, too, which is nice because then you can go get chicken eggs and whatnot. All right. So somebody's slowly sliding off. Are you sliding? Are you sliding, pretty girl? All right. Also, they have the wild animals, and that's got a bunch of different ones. If you want to pause it to read it, I don't really don't want to take up much time doing these because we'll be here until tomorrow and then you're not going to be happy with me. It has a rhinoceros. I'm looking for the giraffe. That's what it got me. It's a giraffe. Imagine that. An ostrich, crocodile. There's all kinds. There's a giraffe in here. Believe it or not. There really is. Okay. And I also got these stickers because with these stickers they're cute. They're like the little animals. There's 68 of the stickers on here. They're by Jop. Which is, I love Jot. Okay, so Jot is awesome. They got a lot of good stuff. Yeah. You really like Jot too? Oh, thanks. Mm, give me kisses. Alright, so what I'm doing with the stickers is I'm taking what I got this puzzle for. It's 48 pieces. And I'm going to embellish these puzzle pieces and make Christmas ornaments out of them. I might do a tutorial on that. I'm not sure yet. It's going to be one of those things. I also grabbed the gluten-free breakfast, brunch, and beyond, which this looked really interesting. Um, she's getting down. All right. That way I can scan through the book better instead of doing just one hand. I could do two. All right. This was $19.95, but the Dollar Tree, it's a buck. It's got some good illustration pictures, not a lot of them, but a few. Just enough to make you, when you're hungry, want even more. And my one son's girlfriend is gluten intolerant. Actually, my daughter is as well. She probably should follow this, but she does it as well as my son's girlfriend does. And she'd probably kill me for saying it, but that's all right. All right, also, I got the 200 gluten-free recipes. This is another nice book. I have no idea what the price was on this one. This has got some really nice pictures to show you. I think each page has, it's like, a picture. each page has a picture. It's awesome. A ton of different things in there. Excuse me, my nose is itching. If I start coming down with a cold after being in my basement at work, I'm going to cry. Alright, gluten-free cooking. This is a... Hamlin Healthy Eating? I don't know. It has 61 gluten-free recipes. Another one. So, I'm going to give these to her because I know she can't have her gluten and my son makes things for her. This has got some nice illustrations in here as well. Okay? So, those are those. The gluten-free ones. And then, get this. They have Miss K. Does anybody remember when Duck Dynasty was like a big thing. I was like, oh, Duck Dynasty. Everybody was watching it. Everybody wanted to be like Duck Dynasty. Everybody loved Uncle Sal or Uncle Uncle Sal. I don't know. I might have forgot. It's been a while. Anyways, Miss Kay's. It's got all her recipes in here. It's got a little bit about the family in here as well. So in case you want to have a little jolt back of Miss Kay with Redneck City from Duck Dynasty. I ended up getting two of those because if you guys can refer friends and family to my page, you verify that your friend has, I can verify actually that your, your friends have joined. Let me know who your friends are. Send me a message and I will, the, mo the person who gets the most friends to subscribe to my channel and like, they're going to get this Miss K book. Okay? That's one of my giveaways that I'm going to do. So, I'll give you until Sunday. So, today is Tuesday. 
You've got until Sunday. Start of a new week. Sunday is when I'll do the drawing. Okay. I also got these because I thought these were very pretty. They're like a 3D. I don't know if you can see them. These actually I took out of the box. These were in the Herkimer store, which I was kind of shocked that they actually had something like this. They're the little poppy ones. I love the flowers. I like life is on there. And these I'm going to probably make ornaments with as well. Also, I just got today. Now, I don't know if any of you have seen. If I hold it upside, the right side up, you guys will be able to see it better. If any of you have seen these new calendars that they've got out, I love this because it has this side where you can actually write all of, you know, little cliff notes. If you answer the phone quick and at work, because this is what mine's for, is for work. I'm sure you could use it for your home phone and you could write a hurry up quick note on, you know, oh, you know, car insurance due, whatever date. And then on here, you know, obviously your dates and stuff like that. Then it's got the full year right here in the corner too, which I like. I like having the full year available to me so I can say, oh, wait, this say this or this. Or you can figure out what pay days you're getting paid too. Whatever. Whatever you want to do. So I did bring that inside because I wanted you all to see that. And I also bought this one because this one's awesome as well. This one actually starts next month, which... Yay! Go Dollar Tree! Go Ja! Smart move. I love this one. It's in the pink. It's in the three ring binder thing. So this one you can actually put in your three ring binder right at work and bam! You got that. How can you beat that one? And I also got this. This is the reusable dry erase pocket. It actually, this is in here. It's actually supposed to be for kids to, you know, to add and do math and stuff like that. But I figured, you know what, a lot of times I'm out of the office and because I'm downstairs in the basement, not everybody knows, you know, I'm going to be back within 10 minutes, hopefully, you know, whatever. So actually I could put on here with a piece of white paper in here, be back in 10 minutes, went to wherever. So they can find me because I'm all over the building. I never know where I'm going to be. Also, I grabbed these. These are the chatties, which are the little sock that is a, definitely a no-show. It just goes around the edge of your foot sock. My daughter wears these all the time. That's what she lives on, between these and the you know, ones that are right down to the low ankle. At any rate, these are a better deal than the Dollar Tree ones. A, they're a brand name. B, you get three pair. The Dollar Tree ones, I think you get one pair, if I'm not mistaken. Three pair. So today I had to wear my one shoes, and I didn't have any of these. And I never really tried them, to be perfectly honest with you. I'll see how they are. Only because I got a bigger foot. I got a size 10. So whatever. We'll see. We'll see how it works. Also in the Dollar Tree in Herkimer, they have these pretty flowers. I love these. What I'm going to do, I love this. It's kind of like a starburst mum or something like that. What did they call it on here? They call it a Gerber Daisy. That's not a Gerber Daisy. Um, at any rate, what I'm going to do is because I'm not fond of how the middle looks. It looks kind of yellowish. Like, you can tell it's fake. It's fuzzy. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take some glue in here, pour some glitter in or I'm going to use some of the glitter nail polish that I have. I have a ton of that too. And bling it up in here so it's going to like pop. It's going to give it more bling. And there are one, two, three, four, five, six on this stem, which I like. It looks kind of brown, but it's really not. That's why I opened it up so you can see that it's more of a green, greenish, greenish, yellowish. Yeah, it's not brown. So that's why I didn't like it. But I'm going to put bling on it. These I do like. These are very pretty. Mm, you can wear them as a flower. But in your hair. Uh, there's six of these as well. These are the sunflowers. They do actually have the right name on there. Um, I like how it variegates out from the red to the orange. It's a nice autumn color. They've got their autumn flowers out already. They've got their school supplies out, which is where I got 90% of the stuff is all set up for school supplies already. The 
the kids just got out in New York. Come on now. Really? School supplies? But you got to do it. And of course, when you're not here, I'm buying stuff left and right because I know it'll be gone if I don't. I also grabbed these. These are the dry erase markers. They are the Promark ones. You get three, obviously, black, blue, and red. I'm going to see how those go. I'm going to try those on this little sheet. My reusable dry erase pocket. And see how that goes. Of course, I got yellow, my favorite color. So, I got that. And they also have, finally, in our store, scunchies. Can you stand it? They never have these. They've only had, like, the Christmas ones, like, on a rare occasion. There's only a couple little clips, and boom, that's it. Okay, so there's four of these, four for a dollar. There's, I got two gray, two black. And then I got the bows. I like my bows because when I put my hair up, I like to be able to put a bow, like, off to the side of my bun. And I got the white with the iridescent. It looks like a mother of pearl on there. It's really pretty. That's another scunsy. And this one's a scunsy as well. And I thought this was adorable because this has got a lot of colors, actually. A lot of colors I'm wearing right now. And this is kind of like a rainbowish effect. Or ombre, um, whatever you want to call it. All right, I got this because I'm going to be putting... I got the plastic container. I don't know. This is a green briar product, but it's got the holes in it. It's pretty sturdy. It's not bad. But I'll show you that calendar in a hot second. This is what I'm going to do with this. Now, I ended up buying more gallon storage bags. You get 13 in here with a zipper. No. Are they the zipper? No. Just a wide seal, new double. Whatever. It's the large. So, this is what I'm doing with this basket. And in my cupboard, I'm sick of. They never fit in my drawers. I don't care who you are. I, I can't fit my wax paper, my parchment paper, my different size bags. My cling wrap, which I got the cling wrap there as well. I can't fit all that stuff into my... And then they got the snack, the portion control bags, which actually has measures off the amounts. I don't know if you can see that or not. Okay, but this is what I got this for. I'm going to store these underneath my cabinet, so when I pull them out, they all come instead. Of course, I'll have it full, so they're not going to follow me like that just did. I also have gotten these letters. These were in the poster area. Actually, down near the garage sale end cap. They had a, like, end cap at my store. Okay, so these are, like, the pastel-type ones. And then I also got these, which are more of a primary color kind of deal. Okay, those are pretty as well. I'm going to be using those for different craft projects. I also got the penny stick. I told you before, I really love these. Penny stick brand. You get 12 ounces in here of the pretzel sticks. These last me quite a while. So this is a repurchase as well. I also grabbed this calendar. It's got the little bottom here to it should open it up so you can see it. This is another 2020 calendar. I'm not sure. I think I'm going to use this one right at home because I really like this print on here as well. They had different ones, but this is the one, of course, it was way in the back. I had to reach as far back. So, yeah, it does. It has a little thing to open it up so you can lay it out. And, bam, you know your months, write what you want to write, or just so you know what day it is when you're paying your bills, whatever. So I really like this one. I'll put that back away later. All right, also, as I've told you, I recently moved, which I'm slowly getting there. Sorry, my apartment looks like it. Mac truck might have hit it, but I'm still trying to figure out, do I want to put this here, do I want to put this there, wherever. You can see I tried to pull this sticker off of this putty knife. All right, so I got a putty knife at the Dollar Tree. And I also got some putty, which actually right now doesn't feel like there's anything in there, but it's sealed tight, so there must be something in there. And this is the Lightweight Spackling. Now, this exact one was a lot more at Walmart for this spackling. I want to say it was $4.95 for this little bit. Yeah. You gotta watch. 
not the, just because the person that lived here before, I'm going through and I'm painting now, and I want to cover up some of the holes that they made as far as um, different things that they hung up because I'm not hanging it in the same spot that they hung it. So, whatever. All right. Also, I grabbed this LA Colors Lip Duo, which I love this color. I'm hoping it's going to like me. Sometimes they get a color and it's like, oh, no, that's not me at all. But we shall see. I'm going to open this to see if I'm going to like it. Oh, it even opens from opposite ends. Look at this. This is the gloss part down here. Got the little wand. That's on the bottom. And then this is your top. Oh, it's going sideways. Must have been in the car too long. Huh. So, let's see. People put this on their hand. You can't tell. On your hand. Oh, this might not be the time they're trying this out. It almost feels like it's melting. Is it me? Anyways. So, I figured I'd try it. What the heck. All right, it's supposed to be a hydrating duo. I think this is your hydrating part. Just to put this on. I always get my peaks. Oh, it smells like bubble gum. It smells like bubble yum. I haven't had that in years. I don't even know why that came to my head. Anyways, this is probably going in my refrigerator first. I can't believe it's melted. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. I haven't bought this kind of stuff in forever, so obviously I haven't put it on in forever either, because I just can't. All right, so I got paper towels, the Mega. I've gotten these before. Hey, if you need paper towels, you'll grab them. Buck, can't beat it. Also, there's my son calls this, SHIT tickets. Yeah. All right, got those as well. And there goes my fan again. Sorry. I can't. I got this half rigged. If you saw the way I had this, you'd die. Okay. Now my grandson, who is turning one tomorrow, needs socks. So I got a boatload of socks. And I got a couple of washcloths for him. And I got the flamingos, which I forgot to get the batteries. Those are growing up on my cupboard. The little lights. This is the only ones they had. I wanted to put them all across my kitchen up here because I've got a shelf thing, but it's not going to work because I got it might end up going on my baker's art shelf. Also, I got these because I have one now that was in here. I got this one because this can go in the bathtub, and then this one can go in my kitchen sink because I've got a double sink. So I'm going to put one on one side, and this one's going in the bathtub to keep my long hair from going down the drain. Or precious is there when I give her her bath. <laughs> nah. I don't know who's who's calling me and harassing me because it's an unknown and it, it's got to be one of those robo caller things. It goes all day, all night, all these different random numbers, so I know it's a robo caller. And they make it look like they're from this area. They're really not. I know they're not. Because I... There's no reason for them to be calling me at this hour. I don't even know who it is. But anyways. I also finally found... I almost dropped on the floor. The Rosy Lips Vaseline. I'm putting this away. Until... I'm afraid to look and see if that's melted. Vaseline. Um, at any rate, I got that because I'm putting that away for the winter. And I also got myself another pair of kitchen scissors. I like this because it has the opener in the middle. I don't know if any of you are aware of this. Like if you got a bottle cap that you need to pull off, some of those ICB or IBC, whatever those initials are, I something, um, you can actually pull it off with that. Okay. Now we're getting close to 25 minutes here. So, I apologize, but I've got to show you all my stuff that I got because i got to get this done. Alright, I got these socks. Aren't they adorable? Two pair. 
Can you stand it? Look at the little sailboats on it and look at the little navy blue. Adorable. Those I'm going to love for my grandson. And as fast as he's growing out of them, you don't need more than this. Trust me. Um, I also got free hugs and little stripes on the tops of these. That's cute too. And I think my favorite one is this one. The little whale and the polka dots. How cute is this? Cute, cute, cute. And I got him a special washcloth so he can have a little fun friend while he's in the bathtub. This little duck. It's a little washcloth. It opens up. And I've got this one. My sister, who's probably watching, she will get that. And I got this one for Precious. So she can play. And what I'm going to do with this, because it's been so hot, like today would have been a perfect day to have this in the refrigerator instead of here. What I do is I put it in the refrigerator, you wring it out good, put it in the refrigerator so it's something nice and cold, and play with her just, you know, you can tug a little bit. Not too much though, because you got to really pull the head and stuff. Probably pop off, but yeah, it's entertainment for her for, I don't even care. All right, and I had to get this for her for this fall or early winter, whatever. How stinking cute is this? They had the bandanas and look at, they Velcro. She doesn't like Velcro, so I'm not doing the noise. But she'll run and hide when she hears it. If she didn't already, which she's gone. Percy, come here, come here. Come here, girl. All right, well, she's not coming. She must have heard the word Velcro. Now she's hiding. Uh, with that, all I I had to show you everything. I've been holding this stuff aside. I've got to get it in my covers, get stuff taken care of, bring stuff to work, all that fun stuff. So it is early evening for me. I hope everybody's having a good day, week weekend whatever it is for you um morning if you're having a good morning i hope you're having your cup of coffee and i hope you enjoyed this video like i said give the thumbs up don't forget sunday i'm gonna go live and give out this cookbook refer your friends make sure they like and subscribe so that i can give you this book okay so i'm slowly getting my numbers up but i'd like to add more I know I'm being greedy, but whatever. Everybody have a good one and take care and peace out.